In the wake of reports of a 26-year-old millionaire killing his girlfriend at his Lagos State apartment, OAP Dalton has dished out an advice to parents about gifts from their kids. The media personality stated that parents should normalize rejecting some gifts from their kids. OAP Dalton averred that expensive gifts should be rejected by parents when they can't equate its value with what their children do for a living. He tweeted, Dear parents, let's normalize rejecting some gifts from our kids. Sometimes when your kids buy you expensive gifts and you can't equate what they do to what they give you or you don't know how they make their money, you can reject it. They are still your children and they'll be alright. The chairman of the Tarawa State Chapter of the People's Democratic Party, Abubakar Bawa, has been removed by high court. The court, which declared his stay in office as invalid, unconstitutional, null and void, ordered the reinstatement of Alaji Inua Bakari as acting chairman of the party. Justice No O.S. Adi gave the judgment in a lawsuit which has Ibrahim Abdullah, Channing S. Moses and Alaji Inuwa Bakari as plaintiffs and the People's Democratic Party and Abubakar Bawa as defendants. A Nigerian activist, Wasapin, has asked that former President Buhari be brought back to office. He made the call on his Twitter handle as Nigerians grapple with the latest increment in petrol pump price, which went from 488 naira to 617 naira per liter. The activist posted a photo of the former president on his handle and wrote, Bring this man back.